Hi there, it's Mikey from Mikey's Mail, and I bought a sewing machine from Walmart. It's the Brother LS2125, and it has a front loading system for your bobbin underneath, and it took me two hours to actually figure out what I was doing wrong. Went online, the videos suck. So this is what's happened, is that when I got this machine, I decided to take everything off the bottom, so everything fell out. And this was my problem, is that I shouldn't have done that. I should have only taken the bobbin out. So um, it took me forever to figure out how to get um, these all back into position because the, the bobbin situation was off. So basically what I did is I took all three rings out, just like so, and I took the bobbin case out. I wound my bobbin to on the top. So what's happened is if you pull it all the way out, see this uh, U-shape right in there? Hopefully you can see that. You wanna make sure that this piece here goes on the opposite side of that when you go to put it back in. And you should have never had to take that out in the first place. I was just, haven't had a sewing machine in a long time. So basically it's just going to sit in there just like so. It's uh, going to fall out if uh, you go to operate your machine. So this ring here holds that in a position. And there's a notch at the bottom of it. So you just want to match the notch that is on the bottom. Holding, holding it in just like so. And then these two side pieces hold it together. So don't pull that out. You don't need to. So in order to get the, this string up through the actual piece here, all we need to do is just stick this in. This notch here, this is what I couldn't figure out, this notch that's coming out here matches to the notch that's in that ring right there. So what we want to do is we want to put that back on, matching that notch to the top piece here. So in order to get this string, all we need to do is you've got to string this up first. So you've got to go through the top and string it all or thread it all. So basically just using your hand, this is going to come down and it's just going to pick up the string just like so. So using some of the tools that they've given you, maybe a screwdriver or a thing, the bottom thread has just come out. So two hours later, I finally figured it out. It's a very, very simple thing. It's just the wrong camera angles on YouTube. Thank you very much.